Rachel from Zombie Go Boom. I'm Sammy. Yeah. Zombies, the bloodthirsty undead. When they arrive, will you survive? Zombie Go Boom. Kick undead ass. Hey, what's up, survivors? Welcome to another mind-blowing episode from Zombie Go Boom. I'm Chuck Murray. I'm Charles Fultz. And today we actually have a mind-blowing one because a Sammy is going to go boom. How do I know that? Because Cult of Athena is in the house and we have these deer horn knives. Uh, they look like tiny little batlets, which is why they're called Klingon pocket knives. They're also called the uh, Mandarin duck hooks. And in Chinese, since they're uh, originally a Chinese martial arts weapon, they're called the uh, Yi. Okay, they're pretty badass. They basically have blades coming in every single direction all over the place. But it seems like an equal opportunity weapon because you do have spikes coming your way. But these spikes are actually not sharp, at least not on this side or this side. They're not meant to be. Um, yeah, it, they're sharp from this edge all the way around to that edge. Yeah crazy so it's still pretty dangerous but actually probably more dangerous for the other person because That's you can do a lot there's even a move that I learned on YouTube where if somebody's behind you yeah you go like yeah right into their scrotum and then yeah and these are meant to stab in and cut out and nasty stuff Nasty stuff. Are you ready to get started? I'm always ready. All right, it's super cold out here, but we're gonna do this because we love you guys and you've been asking to see some real weapons and some real heads explode. And I'm sorry you haven't been able to do that for a really long time. No, the blood's not red, but hey, you get to watch Zombie Go Boom anyway, which is pretty cool, I think, for zero dollars. Is that what it is? <laughs> yeah, but you know, advertisements definitely help. So if you get a chance to actually view the ad or you know, whatever, maybe you're, it's something that you're interested in, that would be nice. Also, 10,000 likes would be very nice. The more likes we have, the more the episode goes to different people. And please comment, let us know what else you want us to test. Uh, let's keep the conversation going. We have a group on Facebook. For Zombie Go Boom people, you check that out too. Anyway, I'm putting too much stuff up here in the intro. Just check out the description. Always read the description. Tons of cool crap in there. Lastly though, if you do want to buy yourself a pair of these deer knives or uh, deer horn knives, uh, there's a link in the description. If you use the link in the description, it actually helps out the show as well. So please, please check out the description. Uh, yeah, all right, that's enough. <laughs> God, one hit, one kill. Oh, yeah, oh my God, yeah, no, check this out. Pinky, all the way in. That's insane. Not even any blood on the How weapon. How hard did you hit? I mean, I hit pretty hard, like yeah. a, like you hit with a sword. I mean, just amazing. It's clean too, no blood on the weapon or no blood on me. Okay, so as you can see, one hit equals one kill. This weapon is definitely an overkill contender, but we're gonna see what else it can do. Charles, what do you wanna try? Well, there's this blade right here, and I kinda wanna try punching this thing. All right, let's punch it on the other side. Sounds good. All right. Woo! Damn, no way! Wow. Oh my god. I actually pulled my punch just a you, little bit. You pulled bit. it so I that you wouldn't it. crush it? Oh my god, look wow. at that! I felt like I barely tapped it. Oh, Here, holy me, It actually pushed skin and skull into the cavity. Yeah, yeah, I wow. mean this is a dead song. How hard that, you yeah. didn't even seem like you punched you no, it. You pulled look, it, gonna, right? I'm gonna do it right here. I, yeah. I did this. Are you serious? Yeah. Overkill weapon for sure. It takes very little effort to get a kill. Like Lynn Thompson says, it's bing, 
Bang, bang, bang. <laughs> dead zombie, dead zombie, dead zombie. Overkill, baby. Now I want to see what you can do if you go crazy. All right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm going to get one for my keychain. <laughs> and not only did it cut all the way across just on a tiny punch, but check this out. It also cracked down here all the way to almost the temporal bone. So we're seeing some, I mean, just an inordinate amount of damage. As Phil Swift would say, that's a lot of damage. You see it? Yeah. <laughs> All the way to the other side, baby. Woo! Oh, baby. Time to go crazy. Here's a two. <laughs> I gave him a you mouth. mouth. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Hey, guys. <laughs> Lame Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Right in the money maker. All right, All right. I guess that's the kisser, right? Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to another mind blowing episode from Zombie Go Boom. I'm Sammy. Yeah. All right, now I'm gonna punch the. Sh can we, are we cussing anymore? Say, yeah, yeah, crap. I'll just, I'll, I'll censor you if I need to. Okay. Alright, now I'm gonna punch the shit out of this motherfucker with these things. <laughs> censor, you can say censor one that. Bad word, <laughs> I, I told him one bad word, now I have to beep too. <laughs> It looks like this guy got attacked by a tiger. <laughs> Basically, yeah. Yep, that, that was it. Okay. Ready, Emmanuel? Alright, so what do we got here? Oh, look! Here, I'm gonna cut it. The skull here, pull cap. It, pull it up a little bit and I'll cut it. You'll cut what? Oh, yeah. Not your fingers. Thank God. Ah, that was close. He has nothing to do with this. Alright, so here we go. Skull cap is. <laughs> Man, that took some of the orbit, too. I think. My God, look at that. Alright guys, so what you saw was some serious savage sort of stuff. If you want to turn yourself into a tiger, now you know how to do it. They're not called deer horn knives because they act like deer horns. They actually act more like tiger claws. They're amazing. And if you want to get your own, there's a link below to Cult of Athena. Please use the link because you'll also help support Zombie Go Boom in the process. Like if you like this, 10,000 likes would be freaking amazing. And subscribe if you haven't. And I love you guys. Hey, make sure you say thanks to Ryan at Cult of Athena for making our shows even more badass. And with another mind-blowing episode from Zombie Go Boom, I'm Chuck Moray. Uh, I'm Charles Foltz. See you next time.